Hi and welcome to Economics Week 8. So in this video we will explore the pivotal role of prices in a free enterprise system. We will identify the many roles that prices play, list the advantages of a price-based system, and briefly discuss the relationship between prices and the profit incentive. We'll also touch on the characteristics of Austrian economics, which was a is a school of thought that emphasizes individualism, subjectivism, and entrepreneurship in, ec in economic analysis. Okay, so prices play a multifaceted role in free markets, in a free enterprise system. First and foremost, they act as information signals. When prices, when prices rise, it indicates increased demand or scarcity of a particular good or service. This signal tells producers that consumers are willing to pay more for that product, thereby encouraging increased production. Secondly, prices help allocate resources efficiently. In a market economy where resources are scarce, prices serve as a guide for producers to determine how to distribute these resources. When the price of a product increases, if incentives producers it incentivizes producers to allocate more resources to its production as it becomes more profitable. Conversely, when prices fall, resources may be redirected to more profitable endeavors. Prices also serve as a rationing mechanism. When the demand for a product exceeds its supply, prices rise, making less affordable for some consumers. This ensures that the available supply is distributed among those willing to pay the higher price, thus preventing shortages. So the advantages of a price-based system, a price-based system often referred to as a market economy, offers several advantages. It encourages innovation and competition, the pursuit of profit and the signal of higher prices, incentivizes producers to find more efficient ways of producing goods developing new products, and offering better services. This competition leads to better choices and lower prices for consumers. Prices provide transparency and information. They convey data about the relative value of goods and services, helping consumers make informed decisions. This information allows consumers to allocate their resources efficiently and choose products that best meet their needs. Additionally, price mechanisms encourage flexibility in production and consumption. As prices fluctuate based on supply and demand, the economy can adapt to changing circumstances quickly. Producers can shift resources to where they are most needed, and consumers can adjust their consumption patterns in response to price changes. The Relationship between prices and the profit incentive is a fundamental aspect of free enterprise systems. In market economies, businesses are driven by the desire for profit. So when prices rise due to increased demand or scarcity, it creates a profit opportunity. Producers respond by increasing production or entering the market, further contributing to supply. This increased supply can help stabilize prices and prevent excessive inflation. Prices also serve as a tool for competition. If a producer charges too much for a product, consumers may choose alternative options, incentivizing the producer to lower their prices. In contrast, if a producer offers a high quality product at a reasonable price, they may gain a competitive advantage and attract more customers. So, to conclude, prices are the backbone of a free enterprise system, serving multiple roles and offering various advantages. They provide essential information, allocate resources efficiently, and encourage innovation and competition. The profit incentive, driven by price signals, is at the core of business decisions in a market economy. So, that is a look at what we will be covering this week, what we will delve into more detail in class. Uh, I look forward to working with you all this week, and I'll see you soon.